All right. Hey guys, so. Story time. Every morning, I take Leo out to pee, and whenever there's sunlight outside, he loves to sunbathe. That's his like all-time favorite thing to do. He loves sunbathing in the morning. Even our landlord knows, and he gave us like private access to our roof that like nobody is allowed to go up to just so that Leo can sunbathe. But today, he was sunbathing outside of an office building, and a lady came up to me, and she had this most disgusted look on her face, something like this, and she was like, "Hey, is that your dog?" Yes, that's my dog. Um, what what are you doing? Why is he out in the sun? Well, he does this every morning. He loves sunbathing. And then she says, "Really?" Yes, really. I was kind of confused at the whole situation. Yes, really. Well, you're in the shade, and it's 90 degrees outside. Why is he out there? And so I went ahead and explained to her. Well, it's his favorite thing to do. We do this every morning. It's like a ritual for us. Even if I wanted to, even if I pull him to go inside, he doesn't want to go. Now, I don't let Leo stay out for more than, let's say, like 10 minutes. Usually, five to 10 minutes tops. I know that if he were, if he were to be out there too long, he can get sunburn. But at the same time, I know that it's good for him because that's how dogs get their vitamin D. They sunbathe, they lick their coat, and that's how they get their vitamin D. Now, he's we live in a studio where our windows get no direct sunlight, and so. It's good for him. Like I know this, so I explain all this to her, and she still looks at me. She well, she can't even look me in the eye. She's just looking to the side like this. The only thing she can say is really, really. And she proceeds to go back into her building. Before she goes in, she snaps a couple pictures of Leo, like she's about to report me to some to someone. I'm like, what? You do you think I'm like trying to torture my dog or something? <laughs> and for those of you that follow me. Uh, on Instagram or follow my wife Juhi on Instagram, any social media, you guys know how much we love Leo. We treat him like our kid. We take him everywhere with us. He, our our lives basically revolve around him. And for somebody to come and say you're not doing the right thing or you're not taking good care of your dog. If a dog is trapped in a car, or a dog's just like alone somewhere, and it's there's obvious neglect, yeah, you should step up and say something, or find out what's going on, or call some authority, or whatever. But I always stand right next to Leo in in I in I what do you call it? In plain sight. And there have been times where people come up, oh, is that your dog? Yeah, and yeah, that's my dog. And they go, oh, he's so cute, or oh, he's so well behaved. Very rarely do I have anyone uh, that says I'm doing anything wrong but th the thing that bothered me the most was she came up to me with that face anytime somebody looks at you with with that look they're basically thinking that you're you're an idiot or you're stupid or you're doing something wrong 
So it got me to thinking, what could I do to solve the situation? It kind of hurts, you know. I want the earth to know I'm going through something personal. But it could be worse, you know. I could be up in that hearse, going to meet the holy merciful. Said I'd be up in the verbs, been in these curbs, and it's convertible. I'm fighting a couple of cases, but none of them cases murder, though. The IRS hitting me up, but I can still go get me a burger, yo. People are out here jobless, thank God I got the perfect flow. The flow is mean and nice, oxymoron like a virgin hoe. Oh. Yo, I'm killing rappers all day. I'm one of the illest alive until I decide to chill and retire. I'm hitting them with that artillery fire. It'll be I against the world until I decide to chill and be quiet until in the industry giving me money. <laughs> yeah. How much was a how much were those umbrellas? Umbrellas? Yeah. This one. This one. How much was this? Oh, I'm 39. Uh. Oh, this one umbrella? Yeah, they're umbrellas. Oh, I didn't see very good. Yeah. <laughs> they're cocktail umbrellas. Oh, cocktail umbrellas. Yeah. Yeah, blow. For the drinks. Oh. For the drinks. Yeah. Oh, I got it. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Get wicked, but it'll be fine. Nothing else that I could tell you. Find your lessons in your failures. Cause your failures will prepare you for your blessings. If I help you face your struggles with the words I'm speaking. I'm really just helping myself because we are one if you believe it. We got everything we need. Now, just gotta go set up. <laughs> <laughs>